Yeah, so as a, as a speaker or coach, 2020 is coming up, and you want to know how to turn this joint around, right? You, ain't getting the, you didn't get the results that you wanted in 2019, and so 2020. So this, this is what I'm working with with all my personal one-on-one -on -one clients. And so for 2020, I'm asking some simple questions. These are, these are actually buckets, right? These are buckets. I call it the bucket. So it's one bucket, and y'all know I can't write or draw. This is bucket number two, and this is bucket number three, right? Bucket one, two, and three. So for 2020, what are the three most important areas that you want to focus on in your business, right? So now we're talking about what is your speaking model, your business model, and your revenue model. Watch this. So if you say the three buckets, right? So let's just say you're speaking. So your first bucket is, I want more speaking, more paid speaking engagements, right? Then you might say, I want to move people into my current program, right? Then you might say, the next thing I want to do is, uh, what? Get some more one-on-one -on -one coaching clients, right? So in order to do the speaking piece, first, like, let's just, let's assume that you already got your message, your marketing already set, already together. So the first thing you want to do for the first quarter, your first quarter activity. Now, this, this, this is deep. Now I just want y'all, this is going to be deep. Your first quarter activity is to get gigs. Boom, that's it. First quarter. You should be doing minimum three Per month. Get the gig. You get the footage. You post the footage and you build that first quarter. If you do three a month, that's three, six, nine. That's nine gigs with footage that you're chopping up and you posting. Now, we're going to assume that you already know who your ideal client is. And what you're doing is you're posting that footage for your ideal client to see, right? So that's bucket number one. You're just focused on getting the footage. Because we said in 2020, we're trying to increase revenue for 2020. There are four quarters in 2020. And the biggest mistake that people make is we're trying to get it now instead, like, watch this. People say, I'm coming to get, or 2020 is going to be my year. Next year is going to be my year. We hear people say that all the time. What I'm saying is that next year is not going to be your breakthrough. It's going to be your go-through or your grow-through. So stop thinking that it's going to bust open. No, no, no. You take 2020 and build momentum and grow in 2020 so that your 2021 can be better than your 2020. So the first quarter, this is going to be your first quarter, you focus on getting gigs. That's going to give you practice. That's going to help you build relationship. That's going to help you fine tune your message. That's going to help you get your marketing right. And you're building your brand. And now, you're going to see some money generate from this. And once you do that in the first quarter, then in your second quarter, you're driving the people that you meet, the relationships that you build, and everything that you're doing in your first quarter, you're driving it to your program, right? You want to make sure that your program is tight. We're making the assumption. This is tight work. Now you're driving it to your program. You're generating money. People are signing up for your program because in your first quarter, you have developed the KLT. No like, and trust. When they know you like you and trust you, they'll sign up for your program. Now you got money coming in in your second quarter, right? Now your second quarter, now you go into your third quarter, and the people that signed up for your program, these are the people that you offer one-on-one -on -one coaching to. How, but coach, how they gonna come? Because you have developed a no like, and trust. Now watch this. Coach, how you know that this works? Because that's how I built the business. I started off in 2016 with Grindation and I was coaching speakers and coaches. Then I started uh, doing this, the G Speaks, and I was coaching speakers. And from G Speaks, I rolled out Boss in 2017. And the first group of Boss that I had were 95% people from Grindation because it was a no like, and trust factor. And then I did Boss all of 2017, all of 2018, and it gradually built and grew from this one tribe, that one community. And that came from me speaking going out and people seeing me do and be who I say I am. You got to go out there and let them see you do and be who you say you are. If that's a speaker, go speak. If that's a coach, go coach. But even if you're coaching, you're going to have to speak. What are the buckets that you want to fill up in 2020? Last piece. Your fourth quarter 
is all about assessing and adjusting from the previous one through three quarters and getting ready for Q1 2021. Stop trying to make 2000, that, that next year your breakthrough year. This is your growth through year. Y'all have a great grind day. That's a lot of shit.